Oh my god! <laughs> Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we have an unboxing and I'm kind of freaking out a little bit. These spiders are a little intimidating, okay? So it's an unboxing from Tom Patterson, which tells us already that it's gonna be something unique. Also, Santa hat. He told me like, make it a Christmas video. So what is more Christmas than video? nice and warm not too warm also he told me he has thicker boxes for winter uh, this looks thick yeah all right it checks out this looks like the goods i'm gonna make sure this is all the goods oh thank you tom this is hot sauce just long story okay. <laughs> oh my god turn this light on oh my god what is this hmm i'm gonna say these are some stickers for Patreon. Thank you, Tom. I love it. This is one of my favorite pieces of art he's actually done. So it's definitely a spider. Oh, it's a Salteus. <laughs> Very cool. Thank you so much. Ooh, these are really nice. I want to... So cool. Oh, no. I'm scared. I will say they seem small. What is this? <laughs> We're gonna start with Potato Girl because this is actually for my friend. And the reason why it's Potato Girl is because she can break a potato with her hands. Oh my God. She doesn't have any spiders, but she wants one. You like some water? This is a Phidippus regius, or a female jumping spider. So we will set that right here. This looks like another jumping spider. I actually asked for another. All right. Oh, look at that butt. Oh, I specifically asked him for a dark one. This is in the same kind of container, so I'm guessing he might have sent me an extra. We got a mail. We got a mail in the house. Okay, okay. I mean, I'm not gonna say no to that. Thank you, Tom. I'm too impatient to wait. Oh, there we go. All right, so there's actually three vials here and there should only be two. This is the one I am most afraid of, Kalamata Sigmata. This is a maglamorph. It's not a true spider, it's not a tarantula. And this spider has the largest fang to body ratio that we know of. It's in a smaller vial than I thought. The first thing I see is fangs in there. Oh, this is the funnest unboxing ever. Can we always do this? Chinese purse web spider? I did not ask for this. I'm scared it sounds so scary. So I know exactly what this is then. Another that I'm scared of, but I actually asked for this one. This is, oh, she's bigger than I thought, I bet. Macrotheli calpiana. So this is actually a Spanish funnel web spider. So uh, a lot of people know the Australian one because it's like very mean and actually I believe it's deadly. This is not the case. This is a much more mild venom. Of course you want to avoid it, but it's not supposed to be as bad. So yeah. Well, that was really entertaining. So we have a lot of enclosures to make. So for the jumping spiders, I'm actually gonna be putting them in temporary enclosures. Next video is gonna be completely dedicated to the three of these making easy DIY enclosures. So stay tuned for that. But of course we'll rehouse them into something temporary until then. I found enclosures for everything that I think will work. But first let's do the jumping spiders. Like I said, these are completely temporary enclosures. So we're just gonna give them a little bit of substrate. And then we're just gonna give them a little hunk of cork. Ta-da. I guess let's do my friend Mariah's first since I didn't see this little one yet. Always have a catch cup ready for jumpers, always. Yeah, so I forgot to hit record when I moved to the camera, but this is my friend's. She is adorable. Look at her, look at her eyes. I hope mine looks as pretty as this one. Okay, so next let's do mine. This lens on to see if we can get a better closer look at this being a little shy now. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, so fast. Stop. Stop. I don't want to lose you. Stop. 
Okay, 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 calm down, calm down. Oh my God, she's so cute. This is the darkest Phidippus Regius I think I've ever seen. So I'm super happy with her. He picked out a good one. Oh, she's looking up at me. We have eye contact. Hi, hello, nice to meet you. Oh, she has green in her fangs. Really cool. Okay, let's try to get her in this enclosure. Let's go in, go in this way. Why are jumping spiders like this? Okay, there we go. Stay, stay, stay. Uh-uh. It's only for now. I'm gonna make you a fortress. It's gonna be dope. Oh, she's so pretty. Uh, the next question is, what about this guy? Because Chai is ready to breed. Should I just put him in her enclosure and see what happens? Because I think that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, let's do, yeah, totally. Let's do that. Oh, he's pretty. Take a look at that. Green, hello gorgeous. Do you want a girlfriend? Cause I have many girlfriends for you. So let's start with Chai first. There you go. <laughs> go find her. <laughs> I'll let you guys know how that goes. How it went. What the heck? You guys just met. Okay, enough messing around with the cute ones. We have these crazy I don't even, I don't even, I'm scared. I, I'm not 100% sure about these enclosures. We'll have to see them first, so they might be temporary. Who do we even start out with first? I guess let's start out with this funnel web, the Macrotheli Calpienia. He told me that this cannot climb smooth surfaces, but it will web up smooth surfaces and climb up that. We're gonna try this enclosure. I think it'll be good. I've been told they just like dirt. Now I'm guessing it'll probably web up some too. That should be good, right? All right, not taking any chances. <laughs> Watch this be much smaller than I'm thinking it, it will be. Okay, I see spider. Oh my God, I see spider. <laughs> As you see, it's kind of freaked out, but there it is. I'm also kind of freaked out, so like, I get it. Oh, it already webbed up. Okay, cool. So all right, I'm gonna do a different enclosure just because, because it's smaller than I thought. All right, we'll do this little tarantula crib's enclosure. This would be fine. I think I will like this better. So now we are going to quickly transfer it over. Oh, fun times. <laughs> okay, let's get it down. Oh my God, <laughs> it is me. <laughs> Don't be mean. All I did was just a gentle boop with a soft brush and it's already pissed. Okay, there it goes. It's found like a nice little safe place under the cork. So yeah, stay, stir, stir, stir. Okay. The Kalamata Sigmata, or the the one that I am most eager to see. It seems like it's gonna be smaller than I was expecting. You can't see into that hole, but I do. It does have very big teeth. This spider likes dirt. The spider only likes dirt. So we are just giving this spider a bunch of dirt. You can go above and beyond for this spider, but it literally will not care because all it wants is dirt. So who am I to judge? Whoops. It's webbed this up a ton like a ton. Do you guys see? Look at that. It was just like, I'm going to make this my home today. It literally tore up the paper to construct a home. Oh my God. It's so cute. This is much smaller than I was expecting. Probably should have asked that. Let's see if we can even get it out. I don't even know if I'm going to get it out without it being like, Meh. uh, this is so cute. <laughs> Why is it so cute and so angry? I am like, I, I, I just, look at it. Look at it, it's so freaking adorable. Oh, it's so mad. It's so mad, wow. Those fangs are huge. Oh my God, this is hilarious. Why is it like this? Like I poked it once and it's so mad. Maybe if I can get her, oh, 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 okay, okay. We are on the move and, all right. Oh no, don't hide from me already. Check her out. She like went right under these leaves. So I just wanted to do a quick little peek. She's really cool looking though. But yeah, I can't really climb smooth surfaces. Look at her short little arms and her big little teeth. What an interesting spider. Wow, yeah, this thing doesn't move fast at all.
By the way, her name is Tickles. What's uh, Wiggles? Tickles and Wiggles, okay. We have one more and I'm scared. I don't know what a Chinese purse web spider is. And I tried Googling and when I typed in adipus venom, it said platypus venom. And that's like the only thing that would come up. So I have no idea like how mean or how venomous this thing is. And there's not even a little sneak peek for this either. Oh my gosh. Although I don't feel like he would send me something that I wouldn't want. Cause he's like, not like that. Let me rinse this out really quick. This is, yeah, we'll do this quick. Okay. Like from what I understand, purse webs do like like make a tube and then like go into the ground. Again, I don't know the size of this or anything, so we're gonna be surprised together. I need a catch cup. <laughs> Where's my catch cup? I feel like purse web spiders could probably climb. Okay, I see it. It's um, it's not huge. Oh, okay, ooh. This is a really cool looking spider. So yeah, it definitely has that like segmented look. It's kind of waxy. Oh, Jesus. Why do they all have such big teeth? No. Oh my God. <laughs> so small and so pissed. <laughs> Can I just get you to like, yep, yep. Yep, yep, back it up, back it up, back it up, back it up. It sure likes to show, ooh, okay, okay. It's another non-climber. Went right under there, okay. All right, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like this video if you did, subscribe if you're not. And you want to be. Don't forget, I've been Instagram to use probably way too much. It's after Angela.cat. You can go follow me there. I also have a Patreon podcast and a Teespring. It is all linked down below. Thank you, Tom Patterson, for more really cool spiders. And let's get into the Patreon pet picks.